Hi, this is Amy, and I'd like to show you some more advanced uh, features of Google Drive. So you know already that Google Drive is going to run in the system tray of your computer, and I actually don't have it on, installed on this computer yet, so we'll put it on here. We'll move some files into it, and then we'll see how to convert those files to the Google format. So here we are at tools.google.com, and then it gets pretty long, so let me shorten this URL for you. And this is how we'll download this software to our computer. So it's goo.gl forward slash capital X, capital U, capital A, capital E, capital V. So let's go ahead and download it, and then we'll come right back. Computer, and I'm going to click on the Google Drive button up here and I'll open the Google Drive folder. Now, in the past, I've been using Dropbox to store all of my non Google files, so I'm going to go ahead and open my Dropbox up next door to my Google Drive and take a Word document and drag it over. So here's a document, dot doc, called QR Code Stuff, and I'm going to take this dot doc and I'm going to drag and drop it off into my Google Drive folder. And then in a minute we'll find it online via our Google Docs Drive. So before we go on, you can see, here it is, right here inside my Google Drive, and you can see the little um, arrows there indicating that the file is being uploaded. All right, so now let's go into our Google Drive and let's find a Word document and let's see how we can convert this so that we can use it inside Google Docs. On this particular computer, I don't have Microsoft Office installed, so I would need to use Google Docs to edit this document. So I've just searched for .doc up here at the top and I found a file and um, I'm going to put a check mark by it and we'll look at the options. So now we've got a check mark by our document and let's go and look and see what we can do using the more menu right up here. We can choose now to export to Google Docs. Now when we do this you can see the message making a copy in Google Docs format. So our .doc is still going to be there but we're also going to have a Google format. So here it is and you can see that one of the icons is the W and the other one is the Google Apps icon. So here it is, the Create Space template, and it's all formatted now for Google, and I'm able to open it and use it. But let's look at another way. Let's say that we really want all of our files to upload as Google Docs to begin with. Now, I don't know whether this is going to impact the files that upload from my computer. I don't think it is. So if I drag and drop something over, this is not going to going to fix those all into Google Docs. But what I can do is if I choose to upload using this button right over here, then I can choose Convert Uploaded Files to Google Docs Format. And I can choose not to turn on Confirm Settings before each upload, and then any .doc file that or XLS or PPT that can be converted will automatically be converted. I can also choose to convert text from uploaded PDFs and image files. Now, PDFs are not going to come over into Google Docs and be infinitely editable like a Word document is, so don't expect too much, but you can change those, or you can choose to confirm settings on each upload, and in that case, let me show you what the dialog looks like. In that case, you'll see this little dialog each time. So you'll be able to choose right here to convert your documents or your PDFs right in the upload dialog, and you can click Start Upload. So hopefully that helps answer your question. Have a great day.